Hello, and welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm Joe Flash, and I'm back with another reaction video. So, yeah, you probably were expecting me to make to start my gameplay series of WW13 for the Wii Altitude Era Mode. I still have not done it yet, and I'm still not sure when I'll start it. I'll probably maybe do it either Friday after I come home from college, or maybe in the weekend, probably, because... Honestly, it just feels more better if I was to do this over a weekend, or Friday after college, you know what I mean? Because... You know, on the weekend, I have plenty of days to make as many videos as I want to, you know, so... I'm either gonna probably wait to save it for the weekend or something to play WWE 13 for the Wii Alta Terror Mode, so I'm sorry to keep y'all waiting, but... Until then, I'm gonna continue checking out more videos. So today, I'm here to react to, yet again, more My Little Pony Equestria Girls related videos. So... <clears throat> another two-patch of My Little Pony Equestria Girls videos, SFM, that I have not seen yet. Uh, this one that I'm about to get ready to check out in just a bit, I'm going to be reacting to two yet again. This one I'm about to get ready to check out is called... Okay, for some reason the title won't appear. Let me, let me just get out of here. Hold on. It's called SFM Ponies Fluttershy Tries to Read. And then the second one I'll be checking out after that, which is made by the same YouTuber, Julio, however you say the last name. SFM Ponies Beef is for Base. So, I'm going to check out this one first. Or, actually, actually, maybe I should check the other one out first, Pony B is for base, because when I searched up to see, because I saw this video on my home videos, you know, like, request videos, you know, recommended videos, and SF and Pony Flourish I Tries to Read was one of them, and I looked up this YouTuber's channel to find out if he had any others, and apparently he has another one, which is SF and Pony's B is for base, so... Maybe perhaps I should check B is for base first because that was the video that was uploaded first before Fluttershy tries to read. So, change of plans. I'm going to check out B is for base first. So, let me go ahead and just pause it. Sorry. So, before I get. So, yeah, I'm going to check out B is for base first because that was the video that was uploaded first before Fluttershy tries to read. It's best to go in the appropriate order the videos were uploaded. I don't have to, but I want to. So, those are the two videos I'm going to check out. Now, because I've never seen them before, I still don't have anything to say, so, you know, anytime I'm about to check out a video for the first time on my YouTube channel that I've never seen before, I really can't say anything because they're just new videos, you know, but I'm not going to waste any time at all as I'm going to go ahead and get into this, so, <clears throat> let's find out what these two videos are all about, shall we? Alright, so like John Cena and Triple H always say, your time is up, my time is now, it's time to play the game. Let's go ahead and get into this, shall we? So, SFM Ponies, B is for base. In five, four, three, two, one, let's go. And obviously, for the starters, you got Octavia working out as a. Let's drop. Okay, just slap the pizza. And boy, there's Ronald McDonald. Hey, Rainbow Dash. She looks like she's pretty bored. Oh, let me turn my fan off. Hold on. I was gonna try to attempt to listen to these videos without with the fan on, but it really makes it a lot harder to hear the videos when I have a fan on, so I'm sorry, yo, I have to turn it off, so if I start sweating, I'm just gonna have to live with it. Plus, I gotta take a shower later on anyway, so it's not that big of a deal, but anyway. There's Rainbow Dash. Hey, Pinkie Pie. Octavia, I bought you the base you ordered. Hey, Vinyl. Vinyl Scratch, aka DJ Pony 3. I meant bass for a fish, not a four-string guitar. Return that, please. <laughs> Trixie. Okay. Is Rainbow Dash gonna make the save, huh? Where are they at, McDonald's? What was that noise? What is that noise? Oh, yo, yo, yo. Really, Trixie? Now what? Okay, so she got it. You gonna play guitar for the first time? <laughs> what? Wait a minute. <laughs> Wait a minute. First of all, why is Fluttershy on top of a, a a light pole? And second, how is she that powerful enough to play the guitar that loud? Jesus. 
That would blow my ears off if I was there. <laughs> I gotta go back, bro. We gotta go back. Look at my girl Fluttershy. Look at her. Oh, I thought she was sitting on there. She was hanging on to the pole like she needed rescuing. <laughs> and they were at McDonald's. Okay. I, I was like, what was the worst place were they at? So they were at McDonald's. All right. <laughs> Why is Fluttershy even up there? How did she get up there in the first place? And because Octavia played that guitar so loud, it just made her fall. <laughs> Look! I hope she didn't die from that. That would have been disappointing. Oh, man. If Flesh I just lay in there, just... Whoop. <laughs> was she, or maybe was she sleeping? Because she looks like she's asleep. I don't even know if I see her eyeballs open. Maybe she was sleeping like a bat or something. I don't know. I continue. I'm sure that's it, right? <laughs> I guess so. Poor Fluttershy. Why are you going to do my girl Fluttershy like that, bro? I know, she's not really my girl, I'm just saying, you know, because you know I love Fluttershy, she's a cute one, you know, Fluttershy's the kindest and the cutest, you know, out of all of them. But anyway, now that that takes care of that, let's get into the next and final video of, the, of this video, SFM Ponies, Fluttershy tries to read, so. According to the thumbnail, as you can see, apparently Fluttershy's on the thumbnail, and so is Sunset Shimmer, and Gloriosa Daisy is in here as well. Interesting. Never seen Gloriosa Daisy in a uh, SFM animation before. Gloriosa Daisy was a character that was featured in My Little Pony Equestria Girls 4, Legend of Everfree, along with her brother Timber Spruce, who becomes human or science Twilight's love interest to kind of pretty much replace his Flash Century, for example. Some people have had mixed opinions on Timber compared to Flash. Some people say Timber is worse or better than Flash. And Gloriosa Daisy, I feel like she's an underappreciated character, but... She was ended, she ended up becoming the main villain in the movie when she was discovered she was actually Guy Everfree when Timber was telling the whole story the whole time it was the truth and eventually dropped the magic and had a chance of redemption, you know, all that stuff, which is pretty good. But anyway, this should get interesting to find out what this is all about. I'm loving that the fact that uh, Fluttershy is wearing her green dress that she receives towards the later uh, miniseries or the shorts because, you know... Uh, later, after the four movies were over, they did start continuing the Equestria Girls series by making mini shorts or mini series and all that kind of stuff. And the Equestria Girls got new costumes or new outfits. And Fluttershy would get a new green dress. The first time I saw Fluttershy with the green dress was in that SFM video, meeting Fluttershy in the real world animation, which I reacted to that video on my channel. That was the first time I saw her in that green dress and those little like sandal shoes, you know, where you know you can see the bare feet underneath. You know, not to be freaky, just saying. But the first time I saw that, I thought that was someone that that person that made that video created. I thought they made a custom created dress for her. But nope, it turns out after when I started checking out the series or when I started reacting to YouTuber, Velo Brony YouTuber, Apple Geek reacted to the series. Apparently that was actually her dress she received later in the series. So like, you know, they ditched the white. Her original outfit was the white muscle shirt and the green dress and uh, green skirt and green boots, you know, and so apparently for the later series, they ditched that and gave her a new outfit where she wore, like, sandal shoes and a uh, green dress. It's just pretty cute, you know, it looks pretty cool. You know, all the Quester Girl characters receive new outfits. That outfit that you saw Rainbow Dash wearing, that was the new outfit she received as well. Kind of similar to her original outfit because she wears a blue jacket and a white shirt, except she's not wearing her skirt anymore. She's wearing the leggings, but they're not, like, short leggings. They're long leggings, like, full pant leggings, you know. But anyway, I'm just going to continue on, so let's get into the next one. So like John saying, Triple H always say once again, your time is up, my time is now, it's time to play the game. So let's get into the last video for the day, shall we? SFM Ponies, Fluttershy Tries to Read. Or Fluttershy Tries to Read. Sorry, I sound like I said Fluttershy's name wrong, but Fluttershy Tries to Read. In 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, let's go. Let me fix the quality on this. Hold on. Well, is the quality already good the way it is? I don't know. Hey, what's in the birds? Hey, Rainbow Dash. There's a daisy down there, too. What happened? 
I thought I surprised you. Oh, do they speak? <laughs> Look at Fluttershy's hair. Why did that m make her hair get in front of her eyes like that? What the heck did Gloriosa have in her hand? What is that? Applejack Daniels. <laughs> Applejack Daniels? What? You know, I remember that I reacted to a video called... I think it's called Muffins.Pwn, where Pinkie Pie introduces Derpy to a bunch of muffins, and one of them was called Derp... <coughs> Excuse me. I don't know if you've seen that video before, but I've seen it before. Muffins.Pwn, I think that's what it's called, and, you know, Pinkie Pie was introducing a whole bunch of muffin flavors to Derpy, and one of the flavors was Applejack Daniels. I was like, what is Applejack Daniels? <laughs> I don't think I know what that is, honestly. But it must be a type of drink, maybe according to what Gloriosa's holding in her hands. I don't know. If y'all want to know what Applejack Daniels is, let me know in the comments down below, because I have no idea. But never mind. <laughs> Whose voice was that? Oh, I think I understand now. So she's trying to tip to read, but everybody keeps interrupting her. Hey, Sensei Shimmer. Wait, what is that in language? Oh, wait a minute. I thought she was speaking English. Maybe I need to turn the captions on, because apparently they're speaking in a different language. I saw so I, You heard Sunset Shimmer. She was speaking another language, so... I better put the captions on. So let me hear. What is she saying in her language again? I bet that's surprised. Yeah, that's Rainbow Dash speaking. I'm going to keep the captions on, so I'll be able to know what they're saying in the language. So I don't understand that language. Must report to be denied by the authorities. Is there a pun? <laughs> well, she slowly turns her eyeballs. Yeah, Flora tries trying to concentrate on reading. Cowboys from hell, what? What? Oh, is that the book she's reading? The Cowboys from Hell? Ew! Whoa, sunset! <laughs> Jesus! Golly! It's not like a bullfrog. What even is that drink she's drinking anyway? But golly, does she really have to burp? Ew. Excuse you, Sunset Shimmer. Ew! Stop it! <laughs> she's annoyed, look. She's gonna get mad. Stop it! Oh, she's moving. <laughs> okay, she had a rage moment and just threw the book. <laughs> okay, so apparently every time Fluttershy tries to tip to read, everybody just keeps interrupting her. Yeah. I'm pretty sure there's a lot of restricted people like this that would love to just read by themselves in a library or in a peace spot. And everybody just keeps approaching them, interrupting them. And they eventually get go into a berserk. They can't even read their own darn books because everybody just keeps approaching them. I'm pretty sure probably I've made mistakes like that before. I mean, I don't know if I have, but I'm sure I probably have done it. And I'm sure if I was to have read a really good book, I'm sure I'd be getting disappointed too, wanting to get into the good part. Anyway, next. I don't read books very often, but, you know... Hey, Rarity. What's that creature she's got? Is that a bird? Oh, she's having a phone out. Is she playing Pokemon Go? Why would you do that?
Oh, there's the book. Ta-da! Ta-da! <laughs> oh, boy. I thought Fluttershy was about to get mad again, but... I guess not. Dang it, Rarity. I don't know what you were doing or why would you do that. That was just... That was just we Poor Fluttershy. <laughs> she literally just cannot have peace of quiet. She literally just cannot have peace of quiet reading a book alone. Uh, poor, poor Fluttershy. Poor, poor Flut. Okay, that was weird. I don't know what that was about with Gloriosa Daisy just swinging side to side. What was that about? Never mind. She was in the thumbnail of the video, but she wasn't really featured much. But okay. I don't know what you're up to, Gloriosa, but never mind. Ah, oh, poor Fluttershy. Can't help but feel bad for the poor girl, you know, because she's just so sweet, okay? Fluttershy's just one of the most adorable characters I can ever imagine in the MOP series, or even in the Equestria Girls. You know, she's just too adorable, okay? I love the character. I love I love her, you know? She's a, just she's just cute, okay? She's just cute. Whether she's a pony or human, she's just adorable, okay? But anyway, and I guess if I will admit, I used to have a crush on Fluttershy, so... <laughs> There you go! I don't anymore, but I used to, you know. It's not that I don't like her anymore, it's just, you know, things have changed since then. But anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up. I think I'll make another video before I go take a shower, so stay tuned for the next video. Uh, you'll see what it is. <clears throat> anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up, and uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next video, y'all. So... That'll be it for today, guys. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Just like it, give it a thumbs down. Join me next time for the next video. To all you boys, men, and guys out there. Fist bumps good to all of you. And to all the girls, ladies, and women out there. Kisses good to all of you. But until then, this is Joe Flash signing off. And have a good day.